What's up guys, welcome to new Unreal Engine 5 video. Today I want to show you how to play your Unreal Engine 5 games directly in the browser. We will take a look at Unreal Pixel Streaming Technology and Arcane Marriages platform. So with that said, let's take a look. Alright, so here I am, as you can see, I'm literally playing in the browser through the Arcane Marriages platform. And I can basically go ahead and play this Unreal Engine project in the browser. Okay, so everything is running on the browser through servers okay so this is not running on my computer or anything like that i can go ahead and change the floor pretty cool and overall i can move around so it's pretty smooth even though you know we're considering that it's running on a server but i want to mention that you know there's some lag okay so this right now technology is not specifically made you know for third person shooters or similar things is more for experiences and you know single player relaxing games i guess like this one like more of a an experience and so on i believe that you can also use a gamepad if the unreal engine you know press supports it right now i'm in mouse but yeah it's pretty cool or as you can see i'm running in the browser <laughs> which is pretty amazing and i have this spread uh so let's go ahead and take a look at another spread and now for example i'm in the crop out example so I create a new game. And this is uh, a demo from Unreal, okay, which they made for a uh, simple project. And now we have it here in Pixel Streaming. And this is pretty cool. So I'm literally playing in the browser this Unreal Engine game, which is pretty impressive. Let me mute it because right now, if not, we cannot hear anything. But as you can see, I'm playing the game. I mean, I don't know really what to do in this game, right? I guess we need to build, but you get the idea, right? Um, We literally you know go ahead and are playing this game so like i mentioned it is super smooth the only thing is that there's some uh delay like i mentioned but for this types of games is it's okay right unless it's a competitive game or something like that in this case we don't need you know that super um interaction or anything like that so some delay won't really be a big issue overall i think oh yeah i need to drag okay yeah i can see i'm playing this game <laughs> which is pretty cool right Let's go ahead and check out another project. Okay, so here I'm in Lyra and you know, I want to mention that this is a kind of competitive game and right now it's going pretty smooth, okay? There's some delay like I mentioned, but it's pretty okay. So let's go to, um, you know, elimination for example and let's see how this goes. So it's loading everything in. There we go, I'm here, okay. So I can go ahead and walk around and I can play the game. I can shoot and you know, Pretty cool. There you go, pretty cool. That, um, sometimes it does give some little lags in this specific pride, but I think that because of the shaders compound, as you can see, there's not any more lags going on. So I guess it was only at the beginning, right? Uh, when it was loading the shaders. Now it's pretty, pretty smooth. But again, it's uh, with a little lag, so it's hard to aim and things like that, you know? So I guess that this platforms and pixel streaming right now are more built for casual games and experiences, right? Like crop out, for example, rather than a third person shooter. But still, I mean, I'm playing Lyra in the browser, which is amazing and, you know, has all the quality, you know, Nana, Lou and everything, which is amazing, right? It's super, super cool, I must say. So, Arcane Mirage offers the most affordable option for pixel streaming out there. They are aiming to do interactive project streamings and innovate in the space. So check them out with a link in the description. If you found this video helpful, I would really appreciate it. You could like video and subscribe to my channel. I have lots of Unreal Engine 5 videos and tutorials, so check them out. Now yes, with all I said, bye bye.